for a long time now. Reporters have had unconscious biases about Indigenous peoples and other minority communities in this country. We all have unconscious bias, and we have to start identifying that and recognizing that we're replicating tropes in our news coverage that have existed for a really long time in books and movies and and our history texts in this country. We can talk about systems and the media industry, but most of my colleagues care deeply about their stories. They're under pressure, they're under-resourced, they have deadlines, but they care deeply about their stories and they'll do anything to make their stories better. We just haven't equipped them with the kind of training that they need to understand Indigenous communities and other minority communities that they might be unfamiliar with. I've been at this long enough that I remember the the bleak and dark days when the few uh, number of Indigenous reporters that there were in this country had to fight long and hard just to get our stories on the air. So the underreporting has long been an issue, and we're finally starting to see data that shows that news organizations are getting the message, that audiences want more news about Indigenous people, both Indigenous audiences and non-Indigenous audiences. 